to be a great segment on World of Sport. What's your decision? We're going to have a look at it now because we need everybody needs to tighten up going into the finals, boys, including at AFL House. So let's have a look at these. Now, if an incident happens in the context of the game, then there should be some leeway. But he got two weeks for a forearm jolt, an elbow to the head. No report for Marlow and Pickett here. Now, we see a bit of pushing and shoving. Now, Marlon's just given him a straight arm, but he actually put him in hospital overnight. Quickly, what do you think, boys? No report there. Ross? West Coast, four weeks. Intentional elbow. Could have broken his jaw. I think Pickett, that was just a fend to the chest. No problem. Right, watch this one. James Rowbottom gets cleaned up. Smallest bloke on the ground by the biggest. That doesn't matter. Was off the ball. Board been kicked. No one in play. Three weeks. He just lined him up. Got a $2,000 fine. Three weeks. Three Intentional, weeks. Intentional, off the ball. Bloke wasn't looking. This from a couple of weeks ago. Just That's the one I'm talking about. That was a tackle. It was overdone. Will Hayes, um, uh, Geelong player, obviously went off the ground, got concussion and missed two weeks. I think that's fair. I think that's fair. Or just a little bit on the harsh side. But no, I, no, but a little I, bit I, under. I, Could have I, been three. You reckon? Okay, I'd give it a tick. But, but yeah. I just reckon those ones where... He knew what he was doing. In. Bloke didn't have the ball. He was defenceless. Yep. Drove him in. Yeah, I'm a bit different. I feel for the, the last one uh, because it's in a tackle. Yeah. Whereas the elbow gets the same as a guy who was committing... Well, I think, football, yeah. Yeah, and, you thought he should have And the bumps, I mean, robot, yeah. $2,000 yeah. for Proust. Intentional elbow to hit. If that was, and that was Anderson, the young star, that breaks his jaw. Yeah. What, what's oh, yeah. he getting? That, that's a lot more. Yeah. All right, boys, let's go to this. Uh, there's two things. We've been carrying on about too high. I reckon it's pretty simple. If you hit somebody in the head, it's a free kick. Yeah. Not allowed to do so, but yeah, we'll get that. We've had enough of that. But in the back, can we just bring it back? Look at that. Charlie Dixon into more. Watch his hands. You couldn't get more in the back if you tried. Lloydy, you're the full forward. You used to uh, fight for position. Yeah. And uh, Hawkins does pretty well here as well. This is from a couple of weeks ago. They've got to dive one. a bit more like Lloydy. Yeah. But look at this. <laughs> look, look, look. Yeah, that, you know, I don't mind holding your ground, but you can't push people in the You're back. spot on. That, that is one that I'm more shocked if it gets paid now. Yeah. It's just right. never, ever paid for, for whatever reason. Two that, pillars that, of the the guidelines of the umpires are this. You can have hands in the back, and as long as they don't see the two movements, which is push out, and the elbow extends out. Mm -hmm. So that's the two. Once, and those both are two movements, and the elbow extends, that's a free kick. Two pillars of the game. You can't hit them in the head, you can't push them in the back. Stick to that, makes it easy for everyone. 